Horace Grant played 17 seasons on the hardwood. And he has the hardware to prove it. Well, this is the first championship ring uh, uh, that I had win in the, with the Bulls in 1991 when we beat uh, Magic Johnson and the Lakers. Count them. He has four championship rings. Three with the Chicago Bulls and one with the Lakers. Kept them to win four championships. I mean, that's something that, you know, I will always uh, cherish and have with me. The six foot ten Grant retired from the NBA in 2004, but he still has great memories, some more so than others. I miss the camaraderie with the guys, the, the bond, the friendship that, you know, uh, I had closeness with the guys. I, mean, I still talk to a, a few of the guys, but uh, as far as running up and down the court, uh, uh, four to six hours or uh, of a training camp and hearing most of my coaches yell at me and you know icing my knees down every day and no I don't miss that. Come on girls, good passes. You could say basketball is in his blood. Behind, behind, yeah. He's now helping coach oh, his daughter's basketball team at St. Patrick's do School do in Arroyo Grande. Oh. Last year, they had a 19 and two record. Uh, there's some talent out here. Um, you know, if, if they listen to the coaches, uh, I think we'll have a, a great year. Jump shot, jump. There you go. Nice. There you go, Kels. He's he, he's taught me so much. He's taught me leadership and how to um, shoot right and how um, to like fake out and yeah. It's really fun. I mean, he's fun, exciting. Lately, he's been working with me on my threes, and he always laughs when I make a mistake because I get mad. But that's what keeps you high in spirit. That's not nice. <laughs> Recently, Grant lifted the spirits of some kids in Africa. The NBA sent him there as kind of a basketball ambassador. He taught the kids, but he also learned from them. We, as Americans in this country, take so much for granted that we need to move this country over there for a day just to look what these people go through. And I guarantee we, we would never, ever, ever complain about anything. There you go. There you go. There you go. There you go. Oh. You see, it just makes sense that this power forward just keeps moving forward with his life. I couldn't ask um, Oliver Stone to write a, uh, uh, a better movie uh, about my life in terms of the blessings that, um, that um, I've had stored upon me um, as a person and as a, a basketball player and now as someone in a, in a great community here on the Central Coast. Tony Coppola, your Central Coast News.